Ground is broken on Ashley's Family Dollar Distribution Center. A Waterloo man faces charges in Stuben County. And Meyer announces a recall. We'll have the details. I'm Woody Zimmerman. These stories and more next on Hoosier Ohio News Channel. Froggy 106.7 is all about variety. From pop to rock and even a little country. Mix it all up in a way to help you get through your workday. You've got the most variety on your radio. Froggy 106.7. Who's your Ohio News Channel? Leading you into the future of how you get your news. Local. Dependable. On demand. And now, the latest from Who's your Ohio News Channel. Governor Daniels was among the dignitaries who turned out yesterday as ground was broken on the new $70 million family dollar distribution center in Ashley. What we work on all day, every day, in our administration, we always say is to build the best sandbox in America. We're trying to build the best possible climate for people with dreams and ambitions, great companies, uh, to uh, come and invest and, and uh, create value for their customers and jobs and income for our fellow Hoosiers. Once complete, the new facility will bring up to 350 new jobs to the area. Family Dollar President Jim Kelly spoke about what a project like this means for economic recovery. This country, as you know, are, are struggling and to the extent that we're going to get on the right track, it's going to be through investments that generate jobs. So we're very pleased to be a part of that. The company says it plans to begin hiring in the early part of 2012 for the official opening of the new distribution center in March of next year. Steuben County Commissioner Ron Smith also spoke about what this project means for people elsewhere in the county. This summer, folks, if you live in this area, not only is the construction going to take place here, but also out there. It's going to be a team effort, but we're going to make it work and you're going to have a much improved road. It is also in the plans to move down this road, we will eventually make it to Old 27. And yes, we've even promised the people of Hamilton, we are going to bring it all the way to your industrial park. We're going to make this work. And guess what? Those monies that were left here are being put to good use. So we thank you, Governor, for your part in that. And later in the day, the Governor made a stop at Pokagon State Park in Angola to speak with some Conservation Corps workers there. The Governor had nothing, however, to say about whether or not he will run for President in 2012. A Waterloo man was in Steuben County Court this week uh, to answer the charges of burglary stemming from his alleged involvement in a crime that took place back in February. Court documents said that 20-year-old Michael Allen Ankrum and his accomplice 18-year-old Dylan Smith of Auburn burglarized an Ashley business and stole a pickup truck from the same location. Smith was also accused of